Hi guys, welcome back to Cricut Monday. What I'm going to be doing today is making a farmhouse sign out of items from the Dollar Tree. And I'm going to be using my Cricut vinyl. I think this is going to be so cute. So I already have design space loaded here on my computer. We're going to go to new project, the circle with the plus. We're going to click on that and I was working on something so I'm going to replace it. That will put us on our canvas. I just want to go to images right here on the left hand side. And um, I was already looking but all you do to find this is then just go in the search bar right here and type in pigs. And this is all the pig images that Design Space has. This one is really cute. I like this one. And then there was another one. That one was cute. But I'm going to be doing this when you do need to be an Access member because it has a little A. If you don't have a Cricut, you could just Google on uh, Google Images and Google Images of Pigs or go on to a site and purchase a little bundle of images for like $3 and print that out on your Avery sticker paper and you could still do this project. So uh, now I'm going to insert images right bottom corner. That will put it here on my computer screen, on my canvas here, and I want my image to be seven wide. So I'm going up here out from size and unlock it, and I'm going to backspace to get rid of those measurements and put in 7.0, and then the height, I want it to be 3.0, okay? And then I'm going to lock it back. That's all you have to do with this. This is so easy, and I think that pig is really adorable. Okay, now if you go over here into the Layers column, you will see that this is a cut file, and that's what I want. So we're going to make it right top corner, and I'm going to set my Cricut to Custom, and then we're going to go Continue. You'll see it put it on our mat. We're going to go to Continue right bottom corner, and I have the Cricut Permanent Vinyl. Let's just browse all materials here in green and type in vinyl. Okay, and I just have the Permanent Premium Vinyl. So I'm going to click on that. It will put a little check mark right there. Then we're going to hit Done. And we're going to cut this out next. So the next time you see me, we'll be cutting out this adorable little pig. Okay, here's my little sweet sign that I picked up from the Dollar Tree. And under here, it just had something written about kitchen. I hauled it not long ago. And I thought it would be so cute to put like a black pig on here. So I just took some cardstock and cut it and put it right here in the middle to get rid of that writing. And then to elevate it just a little bit, I used these little um, spacers that you elevate things with um, from the Dollar Tree. And then here's my Cricut vinyl, and it's a uh, permanent premium vinyl, and I'm just going to put it on my standard grit mat. But this is going to be adorable. Okay, then we're going to insert this right under here, under these little feet, and then hit the blinking arrow to load it and then the blinking C to cut. I'm so glad everyone is enjoying my um, farmhouse DIYs from the Dollar Tree. I'm having so much fun and I have so many ideas that still yet to come. So just hold in there, I cannot wait. So as soon as this gets finished cutting, which shouldn't be any time because it's just going to cut the outline, of the pig we're already done so I'll eject it with the blinking arrow okay and then I'm going to cut some of this because I don't want to waste any of my vinyl okay now we're just going to weed it by pulling away everything that we don't want you might hear Maggie she's in there watching her daddy out the window my car battery was dead so he had to get me a new one and he's taking my battery out. <laughs> but here is our little pig. 
I think it's just adorable. Okay, now I just want to take my transfer tape and get it peeling back. Put it right here on the pig. goes very nicely with French country and then we're just going to peel this back and that's what we're getting and we're just going to put, put the little pig right here I think he's going to be so adorable okay and we're just going to rub him right on here going to start peeling it back at an angle and you can see this is adhering nicely to my um, paper and you can reuse your um, transfer tape and we'll take a look at it Okay, I love our little pig. He is so cute. This makes an adorable farmhouse piece of decor for your home. This little farmhouse sign from the Dollar Tree. And you would never know that this started out in, as a Dollar Tree sign. It's so pretty. It was pretty before, but I really love this. You can customize it and you would never know that that is just cardstock under their white. I love how the black and white plays off one another. It's so pretty. So I will see you all tomorrow, Tuesday, for another Dollar Tree DIY. I'm so excited for all these new DIYs. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, I would appreciate it if you would hit that subscribe button and become part of our family. And when you do subscribe, make sure you hit the notification bell and set it to all so you won't miss a video at all. So like I said, I'll see you tomorrow for a Dollar Tree DIY. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. And like I said, subscribe to my channel. Until next time. Bye guys.